What is up everybody? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today I'm out here with my buddy Jeff from Outdoor Influencer. We actually got JJ from Jerry's Outdoors Adventures, but he's gonna be doing some normal fishing here at the lake. But me and Jeff are gonna be doing some magnet fishing. So with that being said guys, let's get our magnets out the truck, head over there and see what we can find here on this lake today. All right guys, and on today's adventure, we're gonna be using the Kratos Titan 2.0. It's a 360 degree magnet from Kratos Magnetics. It's gonna be linked down below in the description. If you guys would like to pick any magnets up from Kratos, along with my discount code Dan at 12. So with that being said, let's go ahead and throw our magnet out there and see what we can find. Got a little piece of wire. Just a leaf. Oh no, we got a brand new fishing hook right there. Look at that. That thing is literally brand new. And I got a nail. Not bad. Some rocks too. Oh. He was banging on all the rocks. Oh, two pieces of rebar. A really long, thin piece of rebar right there and a bent up one on the magnet. Not bad. Got a couple things. I got a little piece of like metal with some leaves on it. Another little piece and an old nail. Some rocks, not bad. All right guys, I got something on here. Dude, I got a scooter. It's an old scooter. Not that old. Gavin used to have the scooter. <laughs> the wheel is missing. The bars are bent. There's no ride in this one. I mean, I could try to. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So we got my first pro scooter. That thing's been down there for a while. Set it up here and take a look at it. As you guys can see, this thing has no back wheel, but this is an MV scooter, guys. This thing has been down there for at least, I want to say two or three years. Bars are bent, wheel's crooked, no wheel, no brake. What a good find to start off this video. Put it in the big pile with the rebar. All right, pulling up. I think I got something on here. It's weighing. Some fishing line. I got some fishing line and a little weird like bracket thing. And I got a brand new hook. Yeah, I have no clue what this is. If you guys know why this has fishing line on it or what it is, please let me know in the comments below. Just gonna pull up, see if we got anything. Oh, would you look at that? I got some pliers. Fisherman probably dropped these in trying to get hooks out of fish mouth. Man, it's pretty cool. Heck. So I got a big old gigantic rock right here. A uh, little like bracket to something. Whatever this is, no clue. And a piece of wire and rebar. Not bad. Wait, I got a coin on here. Jeff! I got a coin that's magnetic. Yeah, it looks like a penny. Go ahead and come here. What what is this? We go check with Jeff. See if he knows what it is. There's a boat on the back. Oh, it's Canadian. What'd you find over here? So I got a Canadian like nickel. It says ten cents. It oh says yeah, Canada. Canadian dime. Yeah, that's pretty oh, yeah. cool. I said nickel. <laughs> I'm dumb. It's awesome. All right, guys, so we just cleaned it up, and it is a Canadian dime. It actually says Canada, and it says 10 cent right over the boat right there. It's pretty cool. My second ever uh, coin, and it's actually another Canadian coin, surprisingly. Pull up, see if I got anything. Whoa, what do I got on here? Oh, I got toenail clippers. They're a little broken, but I got some toenail clippers. I got a little rod. Part of an old bottle cap, rock, a couple little pieces of metal on top, and then I got whatever this is. Weird piece of metal, and then this weird looking thing. I have no clue what that is. If you guys know what this goes to, oh, you know what it is? 
it's an old bottle opener. You would pop the lids off. So guys, this is actually an old bottle opener, so you would pop the cap off. Not bad, there's actually some writing on it. I'm gonna keep these, put them in a good pile. We got some toenail clippers, not bad. Oh, dude. Oh, it's a piece of pipe. I thought it was a sheath to a knife. So we got this cool little piece of, uh, not pipe, I, I mean metal, a rock, a nail or screw, then a nail, an old hook right there. Look at that. And then an old like bolt to like a bridge or old dock. Not bad. Let's go ahead and pull up. What do I got here? Oh, I got like an old can. Look at that. Let's try to get some of the sludge off. Oh, it's too far gone to tell. Holy cow. Go away. Wait, wait, maybe. Nope, gone. Oh, wait. Oh, you know what it is? It's them weird little like chocolate covered inside straw looking things. You know what they are? What? You know the straw things that have chocolate on the inside? Oh yeah. Dude, that's what it is. <laughs> those, uh, where are those? I don't know what it's called. I could barely see it. Dude, these things are fire guys. If you guys know what I'm talking about, it's like a straw looking thing. You can put in chocolate milk and it has chocolate on the inside. It's very good. What do you got over here, man? Look at that. It's Dude. a Canadian quarter, probably like what you found. Dude, I found a dime and he just found like a quarter. Dude, that could be like an old gold piece. Oh, oh, oh no, it. gold's not all magnetic, but I don't know. Oh, it's got like an eagle on it too. Sorry, I just took that from you. I just, these gloves right here work really good for cleaning it off. like an eagle i don't think this is a currency i think this is like a coin to a game really yeah i don't know man we'll uh, just take a look at it and see oh. dude i got a hammer you got a sludge hammer yeah step on it baby get it off ah, that's pretty cool look at that guys we got a uh top to a sludge hammer hey I'll give this to Iron Antler. Yeah, oh yeah, because we're going to see him this week. Yeah, awesome. <laughs> I got like eight knives for him to clean up too. He'll like that, especially if that's really forged. All right, guys, so we got our bucket. We got the scooter. We got the magnets. Jeff, we're going to head to a new spot, and hopefully we'll have some better luck there. So with that yeah. being said, we'll catch you at the new spot. All right, guys, so before we leave spots, these are some of the cooler finds from today. We got toenail clippers, an old bottle opener right there, an old like can to like, it's like a straw thing with chocolate inside. I forgot what they're called. If you guys know what they're called, comment down below. We got a sledgehammer right there for iron antler. I'm gonna have him make this into something for me or maybe just fix it up for me. And then we got this scooter. That's probably the coolest find of the day. Oh yeah, before I forget. And then I actually even found my second ever coin. It is a Canadian dime, guys. That's insane. So with that being said, we'll catch you at the next spot. All right guys, so it's actually the next day. We went to a spot and it wasn't good at all. This spot was literally like completely clean, which is a good thing though, guys. So we're up here in South Milwaukee. We're heading up to Clay's for the weekend to do some magnet fishing with a whole bunch of new people. Lots of collabs coming. But we are gonna be walking this canal over here. We got our waders and all our wet stuff. We need to walk in these canals because it is a little deep in some spots. But with that being said, Jeff, what do you wanna find here today? Uh, since it is a canal, I'm really hoping that we're gonna find maybe some knives and maybe some iPhones. Yeah, man, hopefully. But with that being said, let's get geared up and do some magnet fishing. All right, Jeff, so some of the people might be confused on what do we mean by magnet fishing a shallow canal instead of mud -like. Can You want to explain that? Yeah, what we mean is that we got a magnet on a pole right here. It's a 600 pound uh, pole magnet. What we're going to do is just walk the canal. If there's any cracks and stuff, we're going to walk and dip this in there. See if we can pull anything out. And anything that's in the water that's really heavy may cut our fingers. We can actually use this to pull it out and keep our fingers from getting cut. All right, guys. So with that explanation being said, let's get over there. All right, guys. So we just arrived to canal. We were walking down these stairs. We got the magnet stick. And we we're going to get down here and see what we can find in this canal today. And we are in the water. It's a little slippery. But I already found our first find of the day. If you look right there, oh, fence post. we got a fence post right there or a sign post. Oh, yeah. 
I think it's stuck for that. There oh, go. there you go. Oh, yeah. Get that out the water. Old fence post. Throw that up there. We'll get that when we leave. Fucking, okay, what's uh, that? fence post in this canal, man. Oh, yeah, another fence post, man. This well, one's a little bit shorter than the other one. You know what to do with that. All right, we're going to toss that up there. We just started over there, so we're going to throw everything up there. This is where we're here. We're going to pick it up. We're, we're going to walk. We're going to walk the grass on the way back. Yeah. All right, guys, so I found another bag. We're actually going to use this one. This one has a uh, no hole in it. Another light bottle cap. Not bad, Nothing dude. Nothing too crazy. Across another piece of trash right here. I'm going to go ahead and grab that. There we go. All right. All right, guys, we are coming up to our first bridge, and there's actually a taco truck up there, man. Maybe we'll grab some tacos on the way back for dinner. Yeah. Yeah. My, oh, no, what is oh, that? That's a cell phone. I was writing on it. Oh, wow. It looks like a cell phone, though. I think it was a uh, motorcycle license plate at one point. Maybe. We'll take Who it knows? With us. We'll take it. All right, guys, so as you can see, the taco truck is up there. We're coming up to the bridge, and we're just pretty much looking on the sides. Jeff has a magnet. He's dipping in the cracks. I'm looking in the cracks as well, because you never know when you're going to find something. Got another piece of trash right here. We're going to pick that up. I don't know, Jeff, but we got our first mask of oh, the canal. We got our first mask today. It's pretty fresh, too. Yeah, that's a fresh one. Oh, oh. Oh. <laughs> Jeff just that's fell. Short. Right, guys, so piece of glass all right sadly we came across our second mask already guys good to get that out the water so we're coming up on a bag that is tied all right james got a bag over here it's tied too i'm scared it smells Ooh, what is that oh is that a dead fish dude is this ooh. let me uh get on these poles right here so i can take that little sit Oh, okay. My foot's stuck. Uh, it reeks. Oh, uh, yeah. uh, that's a bag of dead fish. Uh, oh, man. We're definitely not going to be able to take that with us. I wish yep, we could. Nope. That's staying there. Uh, uh, I about threw up. That's a bag full of dead fish. All right, guys, so I just seen something. I'm gonna grab it with the magnet. What'd you get over here? We have a bike peg right there. Oh, you sure do? Man, first first yeah. bike peg of the trip, guys. All right, guys, so it looks like we got our first posh of the day. These oh, are yeah. electric, uh, like, vape device. Yeah. Not bad. It was good to get that out of the water. Right yes, now. for sure, man. Good card right here. I think I got a card right here. Oh, yep. What we'll have to blur that card. up. Got our first credit card of the trip. I'll make it so you can see. Has a this looks like kind of like a business credit card. We'll stick that in there, or you want to stick it in yours? Yeah. So I just got a little like a uh, water Joe, water with caffeine, and I got a little ant buddy on me too as well. Sorry, buddy. Let's get you over there on the shore. At that waterfall. What is this? Got a bottle. Oh, we got a bottle. All right. All right, guys. The water's so deep, but this waterfall ends, and we get to go back to shallow. What you got? I think it's a plastic bottle. Oh, yep. Yeah. Nice Lovely. trash. All right. Well, more trash than the other All right. Time to step over. This is where I feel like stuff is going to sit. Guys, the world is so sad. We were coming up on our third mask already. So far, it's just been trash, which is good because we need to get all of it out. Nothing too crazy yet. You guys, so I just came across something. Oh, it's oh. a little clamp for an exhaust or something. I thought it was a watch. <laughs> I thought it was a bracelet. Not gonna lie. <laughs> I hand the magnet over to Danny. He thinks he sees something. Yep. I Guess what? Post. Another fans pose, guys. Oh. Wow. It's a little too heavy for the magnet. Why do we keep finding these here? Who knows? Maybe there must be a fence all the way across this at one point. Maybe these things are kind of expensive. They're like six bucks a piece too. Really? I didn't know yeah, that, man. That's expensive. crazy. We need to take it to the scrapyard. Yeah, I know. Definitely. All right, guys. As you can see, we have some more artwork over here. We're still walking, haven't been finding too much stuff, but we are not giving up. We're gonna walk this whole canal. All right, guys, it looks like we got a spoon right here. That thing is so old. Oh, the plastic just broke, or no, it wasn't plastic. Man, you know what's crazy? What some people do is they uh, chop these and make them in the rings. Really? Yeah, man, it's pretty unique. Well, we'll take that with us. Cool. I came up on this hole and I got something. It is part of a railroad spike. Yeah. Not bad, man. Look uh, at yeah, that, Jeff, sure pretty cool. 
I see something green down here. Is it magnetic? Oh, it is. It is magnetic. Oh, it's a bell. And I got a nail on there. Must be a Christmas bell. Not bad, dude. That's I'm pretty cool. I'm guessing that's what that is. Good eyes, because I did not see that. It blended in with all of the seaweed. I know. If you look right there, there's a bunch of uh, fresh grass cuttings. So I barely did see it. Bottle. Let's drop this magnet, see the if water. there's anything in this hole. Anything good in there? Holy oh, cow! The nails. No way! Guys, and that's why you dip your magnet in them cracks. You'll find lots of stuff. Yeah. We're going to add this to, uh, I guess, Jeff's little pouch. Yeah, I'm going to put it in my pouch and, uh, you know. Here. All right, guys, so there's something uh, silver over here. Jeff, you want to grab that for me? Yeah. Oh, what is this? Some type Dude, of bracket. I thought it was an e-brake for like street drifters for Did a minute. You really? <laughs> yeah, that's like a bracket or something, dude. Nice. Oh, hi. All right, guys, so Jeff just pointed something out. Oh, it's not magnetic. I don't know what that is. I don't know how the magnet didn't stick to it, it's but. It's like a, uh, a door to something, like a stainless maybe steel like, door. Like, maybe like a meat slicer or something. Yeah, I'm guessing that's what that is. What, what is that? Oh, how'd you see that, dude? I barely saw that. What is that? Some type of gear. It looks like a, a reel or something, maybe to a fishing pole, maybe? Let me go ahead and dip the magnet in here while we're right here. Yeah. Oh, just a couple nails. <laughs> All right, Devin, what did you just find? I don't know, some type of uh, like glass ball. Dude, I mean, that's crazy. Right there, like, look right there, it's got like the hexagon on it. Yeah, hexagons for sure, man. That's crazy. Found something again. Dude, right? it looks like another one of them like broomstick things. Yeah, they must not be broomsticks. They must be something else. If you guys know what these go to, please let us know. Yeah. They're like really light too. All right, guys, so I see something blue. It is another bike peg. Look at that, guys. Second one of the trip. Once you find one, you find a lot more. All right, guys, and before we continue past this walking bridge, if you guys like seeing this canal walking stuff with the magnet stick and you want me and Jeff to go places, comment down below if you know any canals and we will try to head to them. Uh, but if we do that, guys, we are going to need at least 750 likes on this video to do more of this content because it is a lot of walking and a lot of time. All right, guys, we just approached another waterfall. We're going to go down there and dip the magnet and see if we can't find anything in the cracks. Oh, I think... Is that a stick? No, it's another signpost. My uh, Danny just dipped the magnet down here. He just found another uh, fist post. Not bad, man. That's number four already. Number four already. Hey guys, we're down here past that waterfall, and we actually just found another bike peg. It's another blue one. And look at that. This one's way cleaner than the other one. We've got a collection going. Trash bag down there. Danny, what'd you find? A another? bike peg, but you found another trash bag. Let's yeah. go ahead and fill this one up now. All right, we're going to fill this one up, guys. Since we found it, let's fill it up. Dang, Jeff just got our fifth signpost of this canal, guys. I can't believe I already found five of these. Like I said earlier, these are about six to seven bucks a piece. Found something. All right, guys, so I just stepped on something over here. As you can see, the mud's all still up. Oh, a butter knife. That's not what I was on, though, I don't think. It was bigger than that. Let's keep dipping. Maybe it was this butter knife. <laughs> I think it was, guys. That's pretty cool. We found a spoon. Now we got a knife. And all you know right. what? The magnet's loose again, so you know what that means. Time to tighten it up. Yeah. All right, guys, all we need is a fork and we're gonna have a whole dinner plate. Yup, we already got the plate too. No way, what is that? Is that a baby stroller? Dude, I have no clue. That looks like a baby stroller. All right, guys, so we are coming up on this. It is not a baby stroller. It looks, oh, is it? No, it's a shopping cart. All right, this is not a baby stroller. It's a shopping cart. It is a shopping cart. Look at that, oh. Hey. Jeff, what? look what I found. <laughs> If you guys know the shape, you know what this is. We got yeah. another mass <laughs> and some more trash. Let's get all this yeah, stuff let's up. Get all of this bag. Throw it in the bag, guys. Get the mask oh, in the bag. And we're gonna try to get this card up here. I don't know if I'm going to be able to. I Go wonder ahead. if we can take it up there. And we can yeah, we're gonna probably maybe take it up there and then get it up there. Let's set it right here for now, though. You guys, Jeff found a floating bottle. What is it? Oh, it's a Hennessy bottle. It's a glass one, also. Yeah, he just found that floating down the river. Not bad, man. All right, guys, so I found a Sprite bottle in a bag. Bag has a hole in it, sadly. Oh, we're gonna put this in the bag. All right, Danny's got some more trash to add to our bag, a Sprite bottle. There you go. All right, guys, so there's a trash can right up here by the park. Jeff's gonna run the bag up there and then he's gonna come right back down. All right, guys, Jeff's just pointing something out. What is that? Oh, it looks like a, is that a ball joint to a car? I think it is, yeah. Yeah, it's I believe so. A ball joint. Guys, if this is a ball joint, please let us know in the comments below. Yeah, we'll add it in the bag, I guess. Yep. Now go take it up there. All right. Yeah. All right, guys. So Jeff is making his way back down here after throwing that bag away. We're going to keep walking. We're almost to the end of the canal. What is this? Oh, it's a signpost. Is it? 
Yeah, it's like a construction uh Oh, it is too, thing. department. Department, yep. Huh, must be something to Milwaukee. Dip in here, oh! What'd you get? Oh, I, you won't believe it. Another fence post. Another no one, way. look at that, another fence post, is that guys. another one right here too? There's a whole bunch of stuff right here. I oh no, it's that is. part of the construction sign. Yeah, man. All right, Jeff, get the other piece and we're gonna get it all out of yeah. here. Walking up this very head steep. Head back there. Back very there. steep. You wanna put that up there for me? Yeah. My boots don't have as much as grip as you. And we're gonna grab that stuff right. when we walk back. Oh my God, that was a bigger drop than I thought. Oh. Yo, Jeff, I got a basketball. What'd you find over here, Danny? I got a basketball. Oh, it's been blown up. Must have inflated it too much. And then it looks like I got Balding. some more metal. We just That's ran the other stuff. One. This is bent. We're gonna set this on the side, guys. Uh, wait, is this another one? Yeah, that is another Grab one. Grab it, man. Jeff. Grab it. Oh, I got it. We're gonna set this all on the side because that was yeah. very slippery. We don't want to risk breaking our leg. All right, guys. I see something orange. I think another it's another one of those. It's another construction thingy. <laughs> all right, Jeff. You want to do the honors and run that up yeah. there, guys? So we got a something right there, but I see something right here too. Dude, my over. first computer. Heck yeah. Dude, heck nice. yeah. Look what I found. What'd you find? It's a shovel. <laughs> you got a shovel. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, what did I find? Oh, a glass bottle. Oh, man. All right, guys, I am almost knee deep. Jeff just spotted the sign in a Nike slide. He's going to go ahead and grab that stuff. Temporary pull away zone. Look at that. Not bad, man. Oh, so I just stuck something. Oh, I'm standing on it. I about fell over. What is this? No way, another Fence sign post. post. Fence post, <laughs> sign post, whatever they are. An orange. What's that? Right, every time I'm in like a canal or something, I always find fruit. This time, I just found an like orange. What, an yeah. orange, what? I found cabbage, <laughs> apples, and all kinds of stuff, but this is the first time I found an orange. <laughs> nice job, Jeff. All right, guys, so. I see something right here, green. There's a bag. There's something in it. Jeff, come here. I got a bag tied up with something in it. I got a bag that's tied up, but it has something inside it. I'm very curious to see what this is. Dude, it's like beads. No way, it's like a bunch of jewelry or something. Yeah, guys, look at that. Seashell. Seashells? Dude, put this in the pouch. Heck yeah. Check that out, guys. Dude, you dropped half of them. Uh huh. You dropped two of them right there, grab them. All right, so I just found something right here. It's like an old like piece of a car, like a headlight, not bad. All right, Jeff, you won't believe it. Another fence post. All right, guys, I about just fell. All right, guys, we just got out. It's too rocky, I about just broke my leg. All right, guys, so we just got done walking the canal. We just got all the wet stuff put in the trunk. Jeff, where are we going right now? Uh, we're actually gonna be heading over to the taco truck that we saw earlier and uh, get some tacos. Yeah, guys, so we'll catch you when we get over there to the taco truck. Right, guys, so we just arrived at the taco truck. We are gonna get out and get some tacos. Oh, a quesadilla. I'm getting a quesadilla. Yeah, please. Uh, small, please. What kind of meat? Steak. Uh, steak. Uh, onion is fine and that's a lot of fine, too. What's that? Yep. You guys take cards, right? Uh, cash only? Yeah, cash on you. Only got like five bucks. Oh, shoot. <laughs> oh, All right, right sorry. Yeah, sorry. Well, you know what? Let's get two uh, drinks at least. Yeah. Fanta. Oh, Orange. Thank you. Thank you. Got our drinks, though. All right, well, at least we got something to drink, though. All right, Jeff, so sadly, they only take cash, but we got some drinks. Yeah, we do. Got to support the local businesses like this, guys. Alright guys, but with that being said, if you guys enjoyed today's video and want to see more mudlarking, like we said, get 750 likes and comment down below where we should go next. If you guys know any littered canals, let us know. We will go out there, even if it's a five hour drive. But if you guys aren't already, make sure to hit that big red button down below. Smash that bell up top. Until next time guys, peace out and have a wonderful day. See ya. Dude, all right, Jeff, what just happened, man, as we were leaving the taco truck? <laughs> well, we heard some shootings and then we heard a whole bunch of police and so we just got to this area. There's cops everywhere. Dude, guys, let's get out here and look at this. There's literally a cop there, cop there, whole bunch of caution tape down there, and yeah, guys, it's crazy. Excuse me. What happened? Trying to talk somebody out of the house. 
Oh, it's time to talk someone out the house. Holy shit. 